Gary Neville's honest and stinging criticism of Manchester United has continued with the club legend sticking the boot into the current squad for their malaise once more. The Red Devils' tumultuous campaign hit another low on Saturday as they lost 1-0 at relegation battling Everton. The tepid defeat saw 7th-placed United miss out on the opportunity to bolster their top four hopes, especially as Arsenal and West Ham, who sit 5th and 6th, both lost at the weekend too. United's miserable display was in stark contrast to the football on show on Sunday between their most hated rivals as Manchester City and Liverpool drew 2-2 in a high-octane affair. And reflecting on the gap between his old side and the Premier League's top two, the 48-year-old said it was no comparison. I've got very few words left for Manchester United, he said on the Gary Neville podcast. No anger, no comment anymore. They are a bit of a farce, you almost expect it from them. The players are taking Ralph Rangnick down with them. They are bad. When I look at Manchester City and Liverpool, they have humble football players, no over-inflated egos, they understand their position, the team comes first. Their ISNT one Manchester United player that would get into any of those two teams, so why would you have an over-inflated ego, think you didnt have to work hard, or be spiritless? I don't see anything anymore. The rebuilding job ahead of next season is already underway at Old Trafford with the Red Devils looking to appoint Eric Ten Hag as their new manager this summer. However, given the state that United are in Neville fears that the Ajax boss may be put off by taking the job and damaging his reputation, with interim Rangnick wounded by events that are currently unfolding. I suspect Rangnick will be speaking to Ten Hag honestly, Donny, Van der Beek will be answering him honestly, Neville, who won 17 major honours during an illustrious career at United, continued. We know Edwin van der Sar is over at Ajax and will be speaking to Ten Hag honestly. They will be saying be very careful about going to Manchester United because it can be a graveyard for reputations at this moment in time.